on, guys. What is going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. My name is Jasper. As always, today we are doing another q and It's been a while since we did a QA, and a so I want to talk to you guys one-on-one. -on -one. Fun video. First and foremost, I want to say this video is sponsored by Lord Timepieces. Um, amazing watch. You can get it in the description down below. It's a link down below. You get 10% uh, off and an extra 30% off for Valentine's Day using code Jasper. So 40% off watches right now. So go to the description if you want to get some watch. Maybe for your girlfriend, for your boyfriend. You never know. It's a great gift. And also 40% discount. I mean, who doesn't want that? Have you met FaZe Banks? Yes, in a New York house three years ago. It was amazing. He's great. Uh, great chess player. By the way, if you're watching this, he's not. Uh, we have to rematch chess. I mean, we have played like two, three games. You won twice. I won one, I think. Um, we have to play. You haven't been with the CSGO team for a while. Why are you going to any events with them soon? They had the Boston Major. Obviously, I wasn't there, unfortunately. Um, I'm not going to every event. And there are going to be two events coming up. Uh, Skarabice in Poland and also one Starlighter in Kiev. I'm not sure which one or both one uh, I'm going, but I'll let you guys know in advance. Favorite old school game? I mean, I could call MW2 old school, but it's not really old school. I would say um, um, Super Mario, Super Mario, probably Super Mario. Will you make a Fortnite video anytime soon? I want to make a Fortnite video so, so badly because, you know, I'm pretty good at it. No, I'm not that good. I'm not that great. But I have a lot of fun playing with my friends. Uh, I tried to record, but my Elgato for some reason doesn't work like it's supposed to work. It doesn't record game audio for some reason. It doesn't record really party audio on PlayStation, which is super, super annoying. What do you do to motivate yourself? Now, as you all know, I've had a lot of troubles in the past past few months with motivating myself to do make videos and stuff and pretty much talking to people helps a lot um, getting grounded getting back to that first level base level but like I mean looking back at yourself and where you started that really is a motivation so getting back to like base like base one whatever or ground zero however you want to call it it's like you want to you want to go there and be like okay this is what I've achieved so far and this is pretty good so I should probably get going and keep working because it's working. Don't give up and you'll get there eventually. Just be patient. Uh, Joshua asks, how can someone start a fitness channel? You go to YouTube, you make a channel and you have a channel. It's not that hard. Weights and high repetitions or heavy weights and uh, low repetitions. Because a lot of sources say that you should do either way. But I was just asking for your opinion on, on that subject. By the way, I love your videos. I love your videos and uh, face up. Face up, bro. I love you, man. Uh, I I would say is like don't pick one. Like combine it. I like to do. I, I like to do sometimes go low, uh, high weight, low repetitions on compound movements, and sometimes I like to do very high reps and lower weight on compound movements. It's just like. You build, you're trying to build strength and see if you're progressing in a low rep range um, with the higher weight, so you, you see if you are progressing in the weights. And then, then you can see you can see if you're progressing in the reps for a certain weight. So it's a both way hypertrophy thing. You can combine it. You don't have to pick one. It's not like, oh, I'm gonna g gain muscle and I need to pick like a certain thing. It's like, there's so many different ways to do it. All right, Lorenzo Goody, do pineapples go on pizza? I don't think so. I don't like it personally um, at all. So uh, yeah, uh, it's a no for me. What's your dream car? A Bugatti Veyron. Do you have any ideas to what direction your training is heading? P.S. Love every single one of your videos. Keep it amazing question, Isaac. Thank you so much for the question. The direction that my channel is probably going is going to be not only fitness related, more like fun challenges, fun videos, maybe some, you know, some football videos. I really want to do football videos. Jesus Christ, uh, football videos, some entertainment type challenges stuff and also also the fitness vlogging like i've always had that on my channel um that's more i'm on i want to broaden my content a little bit more so it has more variety and i think it's a little bit more fun to watch what up jasper uh what's just up gotta phase up real quick so my question is what's your opinion on tattoos and stuff if you plan on getting any in the future the reason i'm asking is today i'm actually getting an ak-47 with some roses behind it so i just want to like know your opinion on them if you're gonna get any you know, phase up. Phase up, I mean, okay, damn. An AK with uh, roses is a very bold move. I respect it. Only do it if you really want to. So my opinion on tattoos is pretty simple. Um, I 
personally, so I mean, I understand the, the art side of tattoo and I really love it how it's an art and like it's super creative and it's super like insanely well done sometimes and i respect that a lot for me personally though my personal opinion i don't want to offend anyone but uh for me a tattoo i would only set a tattoo or get a tattoo if, if there's something insanely meaningful to me and i i would put it in the most subtle small way possible i wouldn't like very hard example if someone close to me would die like very close to me would die or something like an event would happen in my life that would completely change everything. I would like very subtle, like very, very small on a place where nobody really would find it, um, get a tattoo. For example, I would get something on my foot or something on my ankle or um, maybe on my side or something. So like a place that most people won't see very often. So it's more special and more to you. And obviously I would do it very, very small because I, don't, I, I personally don't really like big tattoos on myself. So I would do it very small. Beastmo24 asks, what's the best way to lose weight and get into shape? Because diets don't work, as everybody should already know. Um, diets do work. I mean, a lot of people say, like, a diet, like, going on a diet is like, don't eat bread. Or, like, duh. I mean, for me, going on a diet is, like, being more conscious about what you eat. Uh, not, not exactly, like, having, like, guidelines or anything, like, something crazy strict. You don't have to be super strict about it. Checking your food and making sure you're eating enough or not enough calories is dieting. And it works because that's the way the body works, man. It's got calories in and out and stuff. Um, so yeah, it does work. Uh, the best way to lose weight is combining a diet, it, like controlling your food, combining that with working out, exercising, moving, cardio, weightlifting, and that's the best way to get into shape and lose weight. It's a com combination of food and training. It does work though. I just spit a little. That's Luke. Okay. Hey Jasper, love from UK here, and I want to know what's your favorite part about making YouTube videos for people. Thank you. Hey Jasper. What's the five favorite part of making YouTube videos? Um, why did you get into fitness? Because I was super, super skinny. I was a 17 year old, super skinny guy, and I wanted to get bigger because I wasn't growing into in length anymore. I wanted to grow in width. <laughs> so um, that's pretty much why I started. Who I was looking up to, like a lot of people on YouTube, I did look up to for different reasons. My dad, my grandfather, because they're very fit and very in shape. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Yo, Jasper, um, if you could star in one upcoming movie, what would it be? If you could star in a movie, what would it be? Probably like Iron Man, Avengers-ish, or Fast and Furious series, because it's such a classic series and I enjoy it so much. So that's probably uh, one of the two. Do you like memes? Everybody loves memes. Hello there, face Jasper. Do you like owls? I fucking love owls, bro. Favorite game right now, hands down Fortnite. Like, obviously. Oscar, what's your first impression of the gym the first time you went there? Ah, I was, um, I was with friends. I don't remember that much, but I remember I was, I was kind of nervous because I didn't know what the hell was going on. There was all these big dudes there. I was like one skinny ass guy. Um, I was like one skinny ass dude, so ah, I was, I was I was nervous. If you had to give up fitness or gaming forever, which would you choose? Wow, uh, I would probably say gaming because fitness is like sports in general, like fitness or like only like gym fitness because hmm, I would probably say gaming still. Ah, oh, that's that hurts to say, man. Damn. It. How many protein do you need a day if you go to the gym four or five times a week? Uh, it depends on how much you weigh and how intensely uh, you exercise. If you are very into like weightlifting, like I train, uh, more like bodybuilding style, um, it it really depends on how much you weigh. I would say like between 0.8 to one grams per pound of body weight. So ex if you um, if you weigh like 150 pounds, I would say between what is that, 132 or something? Uh, calculation, calculation. 150 times 0.8 is 120. So between 120, 150-ish, um, find a good range. It depends on, as well as, are you beginner, more advanced? Um, if you are very, very beginner, you don't need to be like super like gram, 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 gram. Just make sure you get some sort of protein in because your your body is not used to weightlifting and all you will make the beginner gains anyways um so if you uh, drink a protein shake or two and eat your meats you're gonna be fine for the beginning obviously hey jess what's up at first i love your videos you're a big example my question is why do you start training and what's your motivation every day for sorry for my english i'm from swiss 
Switzerland. What's up? Kind as regards Manuel. Manuel, shout out to you from Switzerland. I think this is the first question for Switzerland ever. Manuel, you're the first Swiss person ever. Roger Federer all the way. Um, okay. Uh, why did you start training again? Because I was super, super skinny. I hated the way I looked. I looked like a stick and I wanted to feel more strong, feel more big. And that's why pretty much I started. Also, I love sports. I love challenging myself. So fitness allowed me to challenge myself on a daily, daily basis, which I love. What's the next question, Nick? Will you train with fans? Because I damned you about it. You never replied, bro. I'm Dutch, by the way. Then hello to Hexton. I'm sorry I didn't reply. I get a lot of DMs um, of people who want to train. I'm always down to train. If you... Okay, I'm going to say this. If you want to train, send me like a concrete day. Like, yo, Jasper, can you train next week, Tuesday? I'll come to you or you'll come to me. Whatever it is. And I'll say yes or I'll say no. Because a lot of people are like, hey, can you train? And they're like, yeah, sure. And then it never happens because whatever. I get so many messages. So if you want to train with me, tell me a date and I'll say yes or no. I'm 18. I go to the gyms four times a week. Do you recommend me taking protein powder as part of my diet? Many thanks. John, I think it's a very great supplement to take. If you cannot get your protein sources from other sources or you have a lot of trouble with eating or you don't have enough time to cook or you're a very bad cook, protein shakes are perfect. You scoop it in, some milk, some water, whatever you want. You shake it up. Done. Easy. It's time. It's very fast. It's very easy. It's kind of delicious if you have a good one and uh, has a lot of protein in it, which is great. It's a very great source of protein. So if you can't get it in your diet for whatever reason it is, supplements are the answer. Oh, okay. What was your favorite class when you were in school? Um, a gym class. <laughs> like physical activity. Will you visit or live the face house Hollywood? I will definitely visit. I would probably not live there. I know someone's probably asked this question before, but when did you learn English? When did you learn English? It's actually the first time ever someone asked me this, I think. Um, I learned English in school. We get it in school here in Holland. Um, but I pretty much learned it from talking to a lot of people in English all the time. When I was playing online video games on the Xbox or whatever, I always talked English with people from the UK. And then I watched movies and I watched videos on YouTube were all English. So I kind of picked it up like that. Um, so just talking a lot, a lot of practice outside of school. I don't need to know the exact spelling or the exact construction of a sentence for me to make myself understandable in English because you guys can watch my videos and you guys are Dutch only. You are English as well. American, Sweden, Norway, Denmark, shout out Zimbabwe. So um, yeah, practice. Thank you so much for watching this q and I really do hope you enjoyed it and thank you guys for watching. Call me later. Deuces. <laughs>